We need to swing on arrival inside the harbor once we pass the breakwater. It's about 90 degrees turn. Our trusses number two is still not available, but uh, considering the condition today, it's, it's not a problem. As the captain begins the maneuver, Staff Captain Richard Dalton spots trouble off the stern. Mr. Pilot, we have one cargo ship coming in astern, yeah? Where's he gonna go? Is he gonna slow down? A cargo ship is heading towards Diamond Princess's starboard side, exactly where Captain Arma is about to swing the stern. Sasha, do you have this cargo ship on your radar, yeah? Yeah, it's gone. At the moment, he's inbound. We're trying to find out where he's going. Pilot's trying to get in touch with him. With Diamond Princess already in motion, it's nearly impossible for Captain Arma to stop the swing. How far is she? 600 meters. Huh? 600 meters. If the cargo ship doesn't change course, the two vessels will collide. Okay, Mr. Pilot, he needs to stop. Because we're going to swing the stern. He's still coming. Rate of turn slowly increasing, sir. Finally, the pilot's instructions get through. The cargo ship reduces speed and changes heading to pass well clear of Diamond Princess's bow. Okay, all clear on the starboard swing. side. All right, then let the stern swing completely, increasing the full to starboard on the thrusters. Looked like from the radar that uh, her intention was to come in on our starboard side. And as we were starting the swing, this could have been uh, pretty dangerous. And it's not over yet. The cargo ship should be holding position until Diamond Princess is at the pier. Instead, it's rushing right past the cruise ship's bow. Okay, increasing the speed. Cargo ship is passing ahead of us. Yeah, they do this every day. This is the challenge uh, of being with this big ship in this part of the world. You're dealing with uh, all sorts of vessels. We try our best, but you never know what is happening on the other side. This is the extra challenge in the challenge. By 7 a.m., Diamond Princess is safely docked in Kochi.